Ron Maines here for my father, David Maines. I'm glad to sit in for him on this video version of the 100words.ca daily blog. And so we are in Ephesians chapter 3 today, and our key verses are verses 17 through 19. That Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith, that you, being rooted and grounded in love, may be able to comprehend with all the saints what is the width and length and depth and height to know the love of Christ with which passes knowledge that you may be filled with all the fullness of God. Just imagine the overcoming strength Paul has received from God. He's writing this from prison in Rome. Paul takes on the principalities and powers which manifest themselves in Caesar, the ruler who claimed to be a god. Who is truly free and who is the prisoner? <laughs> Paul's prayer is not just for the believers at Ephesus, but for us too, to be filled with all the fullness of God, which means that we will be fuller than we were before when we were already full. Hmm, how can this be? Our capacity for God living in us has expanded because of God's answering Paul's prayer. Let us keep topping up every day without fail. Here is Paul's three-step plan for becoming more like Jesus. One, be strengthened with power through his spirit. Two, understand that Christ dwells in our hearts by faith. And three, get a grasp on the fact that Christ loves us totally. Our prayer is, Father, I'm making Paul's prayer mine that I would know the love of Christ which passes knowledge and that I might be filled with all your fullness. I pray this in Jesus' name, amen. <laughs>